Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a very special edition of the Walk-In Clinic, presented by your host, the MSW World Heavyweight Champion, The Clinic. And first off, let me say that I think the Abraham, excuse me, I think the Walk-In Clinic is way better than the Abraham Washington Show. I think everyone would agree. But uh, on to further business. We saw some exciting matches so far at Wrestling Challenge, and we're going to see a couple more. First up, we have that big main event. Now, unfortunately, we know that Caleb Starr is not here. The original plan was a six-man tag team match, and that match would be myself, The Law, and Caleb Starr versus Lil Ace, BK, and Nate Dogg. However, yeah. since Caleb Starr is not here, we're still up to the challenge. Even though there's less of us, we're still up to the challenge, so it will be a three-on-two handicap match. But let's make things a little more interesting. It will be an over-the-top rope elimination match. So, whenever one team is remaining, that team will be declared the winner. You're eliminated by going over the top rope, so this will be a unique and entertaining classic match. And now, on to the business that I was originally planning on discussing. That being the situation about how I won the MSW World Heavyweight Championship. I won that title from Lil Ace in, I'll admit, controversial fashion. You know, you may have seen the clip on YouTube, or you may have seen it in my weekly update yesterday, that the law actually hit Lil Ace with a chair when the referee was knocked down. Then again, you could say that Lil Ace deserved it because he brought the chair in the ring in the first place. So. We're going to get gather all the players here to discuss this little issue and see everybody's opinions on it. My opinion, it's just great that I'm the MSW World Heavyweight Champion. First off, introducing one half of the MSW World Tag Team Champions and the MSW World Television Champion, MSW Hall of Famer, The Law. <laughs> Welcome to the walk-in clinic law. Thanks for having me. Well, it's a very special edition. So, of course it's special out here. Well, that's not the reason You don't get any bigger when you get the law yeah. out here. And of course you know how rare it is to have a very special edition of the walk-in clinic. But uh, be that as it may, I was just Lawrence talking. Mania was a success, by the way. Yes, it was, and it was largely a success due to me and you. Well, I won the round. I mean the round robin. Yes, you did. And I had some good successes there, too. Right. But uh, congratulations on your win. Thank you very much. But I was just discussing, first off, uh, since Caleb Starr's not here, I made a fish. I just tried calling him. For some reason, his phone's, it's ringing, but Stay there's scared. no answer. That's huh. not like Caleb. Maybe he's a star, since he's a star, he's out in the clubs or something, you know? Yeah, but normally he gets the money for me to go get down right now. Well, I don't know what's going on, but the uh, main event's going to be three on two, and so, so it's going to be heard. us against the extremists, and it's going to be an over-the-top rope elimination match. He will get with you. So, what are your thoughts on that? First of all, my mind's outrageous. See the kids over in the UK exchanging money. Matter of fact, he's on the plane headed back to Louisiana. Well, the States, is the, you know. So, unfortunately, he's not here today, but the GWA champion, get back safe. As far as Caleb Star is concerned, like I said, this is quite funny. I don't know what's going on. See, my mind's in other directions right now. So hopefully, I can focus on the match. You know, we'll, we'll see what happens when time comes. You know, there's not a lot going on. That's right. And why don't we get the camera a little closer so we can make sure that all our important uh, sayings are heard? Now, uh, I know the kid went to the UK to make that deal. So, I mean, what happens when you carry a large quantity of cash uh, through an airport? I mean, did he have to get searched or? Uh, Private jet. A private jet? Yes. That's going to be kind of expensive. So? I mean, the, the fuel. Do you think that's economical? And, and 
Well, Don't worry, everything's going to get taken care no, of. Because if we can get certain people out of the office and put me in, then we'll be okay. Why don't I have a private jet? Why don't you have a private jet? I don't know. When you have all these... And if you have a private jet, why are you driving around in Jeep? Why? Because I have to... See, I'm, I'm, I'm like with a lot of people in the in government should be. I try to be common. I try to be common. Well, I, mean, I guess that's true. So, you, know, not you see, when I'm trying to be common, then I could focus all my money on expensive things. You know, I could afford the jet because I don't buy expensive everything else. Yeah, that makes sense. So, but I understand uh, that. Also, some other business. We were discussing what happened at Championship Chaos when I won the MSW World Heavyweight Championship. Okay. Uh, that being that you assisted me in, in some controversial fashion. And no. It wasn't controversial at all. I came in, I hit him with the chair because he likes to be extreme. I gave him a dose of his own medicine. He lost the belt. Now what? And that's what I said that, you know, Lil Ace. And wham, 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 he gets his rematch today. So we, Lil Ace brought it on himself. You know, he brought the chair in the ring in the first place and he got what he deserved. I okay, so what's that? I mean, well, there's been some controversy. There's been some talk about it. Okay, and so. He, I like people talking about MSW, so, you know, that's I nice. think we'll just, you know, cover that here on the walking. That's somebody who I, who I hear say something all the time, yeah? He may be talking about how he got screwed, why he screwed, but that's somebody who always says, man, where are they talking? Over there, not over here. So if Ace got something to say, get him out here too. Well, why don't we get Lil' Ace here? Come on out. Come on. Check this out. Supreme nigga, nigga, big cat. Rockin' with Lil' John, Eastside boys. China White, Chris Short Dog. Hey, Boogie Down. 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 Bo